and death are the same. Both can have value and purpose. Shogun is something new to the audience and hopefully something that will be groundbreaking. とても壮大な人間ドラマだと思います。この作品に俳優としてプロデューサーとして関われたというのは非常に自分にとっては大きいことで非常に重要な一歩を踏み出せたのかなという気がしますね。when you think about how much research, time, and how many creative minds it took to create this, it just blows me away. It's just amazing, the scale of it. I've never worked with this many Japanese people outside of Japan. This is by far the biggest, you know, most elaborate, most detailed, authentic show I've ever done. It's amazing. So much of this show is about bringing aspects of a faraway world to an accessible realm for the audience. It's just been truly awe-inspiring, and it's so exciting to see it when a scene really comes together on this scale. This season of Shogun is about Blackthorn, an English pilot who arrives in Japan, and through Lord Toranaga and Mariko, he's forced to come to terms with the view of these people from this unfamiliar land. I play Mariko. She is a Catholic and is assigned to become the translator for Blackthorn when he arrives. And throughout the season, she's determined and has to fight on her own. I just am so inspired by her story. It's a show about agency and control over the path of one's own fate. It's the story of Tornaga. He is a prisoner uh, of a political nature, stuck in Osaka, waiting for his fate to be handed down. え、西トラナガというのはまあ関東の大名で、あ、自分の家族やら、いろいろな、うん、課題を抱えながら時が来るのを待ち、戦気が訪れるのを待つという、言ってみれば試練だらけのシーズンですね。Something that was exciting for me in the beginning was the idea that we too could go on a journey with the character John Blackthorn, and we wash up on these shores with him, and then it becomes something else. He has individualistic notions that he thinks he's going to impress upon this culture and I'm these sorry. people, and he is a character who had to forge connections. Blackthorn has to deal with the deficit between the culture that was responsible for forming his character, and he is trying to learn to not get his head chopped off by people with very sharp swords. Well, go on then. Might as well be now. This story is set at the end of 16th century of Japan. It begins immediately after the death of Taiko Nakamura. The ruler of Japan has just died. My character is Kazunari Ishido. I'm the political rival of Toranaga. Buntaro is Mariko's husband, and I want a happy life for both of us, but John Blackson comes between us and messes things up. まあ、今みたいに新しいけど、キャラクターをやってるんですけど、僕はなかなかそのそうですね、他の人と違って、あまり誠実でない男なので、どこどこなんかこう、怪しげな行動を取ったりしてるような男なんで。もしかしたら it is a story about how we make meaning in our lives, how we inhabit this world that we live in. It is filled with visceral experiences, and that is the power of a great story.
It's about that meeting of people from a disparate range of culture, gender, identity, ethnicity, language, who find common ground. This is not where we die. We should be corpses. But here we are. Hey! Hey! Whoa!